Before we even get started playing this game, I have to show you something. Let me just bring up the screenshot. All right, look at this. This is, this is incredible. This is unprecedented. All right, look. There's no next button. It says n click next to continue. There's no next button. Now, I'm not, I'm not making fun of this. I'm saying, listen, if you can't figure out how to survive without something that you thought that you needed, you don't deserve to survive the zombie apocalypse. I mean, I don't even know how to proceed. I am obviously not prepared. I can't live without the next button. All right, uh, enough of that tomfoolery. Here we are um, playing a game, as you saw previously, called The Hunt. Day one, the plane had some technical difficulties. I have it repaired, but it's not very reliable now. I'm still on my way to infected city. I will follow the buoys. What? Wait, what? Wait, what? This is a not... This is a... I don't... Do I... I can... I can fly the plane? Oh my god, this is amazing! Oh, Jesus, I'm awful! What am I doing? What? Oh my god. Okay, um... Alright, okay. I was not emotionally prepared to be flying a World War II plane right now. Um... Okay, there's a buoy. Oh, Jeebus. Okay, I'm not... Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, it's... No, it's fine. Never mind. Okay, um... I... Where's the next buoy? Oh, there it is. All right, let's go. This has got to win the award for the best loading screen I have ever seen. I really wish they told me, like, I could move this plane more gently, but it seems to either go all the way to one side or all the way to the other. Oh, I just tap it very gently. Okay, here we go. The fuck's the next buoy? Oh, there it is. Alright. It was really nice of them to leave a whole bunch of buoys out here, leading to the infected city. Zombies aren't such bad guys. Um, let's, uh... Let's get on with it. Um, that was awesome. Movie. No, let's play. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, guy. I'm, I'm sorry. It's cool. Let's be, let's be friends. Um, this game is awesome. Here I am. There's my plane. Yeah, that's about how I would land it. Yeah. Not particularly graceful. What the? Dude, sh that dude killed my cameraman. Where's my gun? Do I have a gun? There's a gun. Alright, gun activated. Um, so cheers to the plane. That's cool. Let's see, I want to get up and away here to somewhere where I can sort of keep track of things without being in all that grass. Because it looks kind of like a death trap to crawl around in there. Um, hmm. Holy shit! That's what I want to hear. What? Oh, crap. Sorry, buddy. Ow, I get it, I get it, I get it. Um, my rifle has infinite ammo, but, like, the thing is, my, uh, the sound of my gunfire is attracting more zombies, so it's sort of like... Oh. Holy crap! Back up, back up. This is my steel! Ugh. I know the high-powered sniper rifle seemed like a great plan, but at this point in the game, I'm kind of wishing I had a machine gun. This is taking quite a bit of skill to kill these guys, though. Oh, yes. We have a what? Realistic scope? I can't even handle how good this game is. Oh, yeah. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Not much of a scope guy. Anybody else? Anybody else? I know there's more of you. There's always more of you. Hey, buddy. Oh, I like that little 
little splashback effect. Oh. This is, I like this this scope. It's so cool. It's really interesting though because it sort of has to make you take your eyes off where you would normally put them in the screen, which is pretty neat. Um, oh, it also works even when I'm not raising. Them. All right, let's stop killing guys and let's investigate. Little, little New Mexico farmstead here. Hey guys. Hey. Sorry, buddy. Tire swing. Infinitely rocking, creepy baby horse thing. Little door for tiny people. Um. Oh. I should probably keep killing them as soon as they overrun me. I like how he just they just look annoyed with you when you shoot them. It's like, oh yeah, um, that it hurt. That it hurt. Oh my god. never tire. This car is too small to be a human being car. This must be some sort of dwarf settlement after um, they were chased out of the underground by the zombies. The dwarves came here to live and settled on the surface. Um, and they have cars that nobody else has. Um, this isn't actually a um, this isn't actually a fuel truck. This is a tanker taking their dwarven firewater and uh, taking it out to the people. And that's how they make it. But uh, now that the zombies have come, it's anybody's game. You just, you just don't know. Why is there a weird bloody axe there? Down the power lines. Edge of the world. Alrighty. Let's just chill here for a while. High ground will help us. Back up, back up. Back up. Yeah. I gotta say, this game is really, really pretty. It's got some serious Far Cry. I mean, I know it's a small map, but it's got some serious Far Cry 2 stuff going on here. And I really like how the grass sort of obscures where you're going and you can't see zombies. I don't know. Um, honestly, as, uh, the, uh, in the zombie genre, there are just many, many, many games. Um, and this game actually reminds me a little bit of State of Decay, although its focus is a lot different gameplay-wise. Um, but as, a Dwarven Settlement Investigation Simulator, I, I have to say this game deserves a 5 out of 5. I mean, also, to be fair, it really is pretty much the prettiest game I've played on this channel so far. And, um, I mean, I, I, just can't, I just can't get over it. I just throw a few more zombie models into this and a couple of guns, and this is a really, like, full-fledged, kick-ass game. Um, everybody loves ragdoll physics. I mean, th this engine really works really well. I like the scope. I like... I just like pretty much everything about it. I'm gonna call it right here. I think I already said it. Five out of five. No! You'll never take me alive! Ah! Honestly, I guess you won't. I was trying to go out and blaze glory, but shooting them in the field seems to be just as effective as anything else. I, I, I don't know. Alright, I'm out. Whoa, options. Nope, we're done.